Okay, I got a brilliant idea. So, what if we make popcorn, and then we have M&Ms. We don't have M&Ms, but they're only in trail mixes. So we can just pull them out. And we can, uh, and we can take off the shell of the M&Ms and put that in a different, like a little container, like this big. Uh, then we can keep the chocolate pieces in the other uh, container. Uh, then we can melt the container with a bunch of chocolate in the microwave for however long and uh, see how well it melts. Uh, then we can pour, once the popcorn's done, we can pour the chocolate the uh, melted chocolate and smear it on there and then get the uh uh m m like shell things and then oh yeah i forgot to say and you have to crunch the m m's shells and you grab the shells and put them all over the uh all over the popcorn let's do it okay so we got everything the M&M's are in these trail mixes. Popcorn. This one is going to be where the M&M chocolate is going to be. M&M shells. And then we're going to heat this up. Um, it's impossible. It's so hard to take off the shells. So we only got one solution. Okay. What is all my shoes? Okay. Oh, this is so much easier. This whole time. I'm gonna try it one hard. Okay. I am so close to being done. Just need one last thing. That didn't do anything. <laughs> Ow. I'm done with that. Okay. Oh, by the way. That's what it, I don't know if y'all can see it through the bag, but it, yeah. It's really uh, crunched up. I wanted a little bit of a crunch type taste, so I did not uh, heat this up and melt it. Oh. Okay. Ready for the satisfying? It's a popped. Okay, no, it's not. Okay. Satisfying. We need more M&Ms. Let's try one. Um, we need more M&M's. Overall, 9 out of 10, I give this a 10. Or 9, 9 or 10. It's amazing. You're at home. It's totally good for you. Bye.